Hello everyone. Sorry I haven't been around too often. I've been like literally doing like personals for days. You know. Bashing my head against rocks. Not really. I'm just saying that because I'm being like over exaggerating and shit. Anyway. I hope you all are doing well. I still got like quite a few of y'all to do. I'm actually surprised. A bunch of y'all are coming in. Do, 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 do. I don't know. I've been doing pretty snazzy. I like my job. But it's kind of boring because it's like it's hard to find shit to do. Because at that job, everybody's looking for something to do. And they frown down upon you. If you aren't doing anything. <laughs> Which is like, okay, yeah. Ooh, let's see. So who are we reading for today? Let's see. How strange. It's like somebody wants to take action with somebody. Or someone turned grew up to be an asshole. Like they started out as a kid, then they got a lot of passion to get somewhere, and now they're just some older guy with a bunch of shit. He yells at the kids across the street, you know. If you're with the school or the government, get the fuck off my lawn. You know, one of those things, right? Um, let us go down to one card. Choices, basically. Choices. Okay. We got the layout. Anyone new? As well as my return visitors. Remember, this is just a card game. This could resonate with you or this could not resonate with you. Just remember, boop your nose and away it goes. This shit only attacks, only um, affects the point in time when I'm reading this now to the point where it ends. Things will change, other influences will come in that I probably miss. So take everything with a pound of salt and leave the rest for whoever, right? Alright, so first off, this querent has a mouth, so at least we get that out of the way, that's good. Down below, ah, King of Wands, Leo, Sag, or Aries. So, they talk a lot, way more than what they probably should, but they probably see themselves as the king. It could be a Leo, I don't know, but they talk a lot. Um, thoughts and feelings as they feel out of balance with stuff. People are watching them as they try to perform a pose that isn't quite comfortable for them. You know, like trying to hang off of something with your whole weight with two freaking um, fingers is not an easy feat, right? The root of those feelings is they were trying to work on something with the Eight of Pentacles. Eight plus negative three is five, so now they might be feeling left out in the cold. A lot of illusions and shit finally came to the surface. Cancer or Pisces. Some things might have been revealed. Someone doesn't want to like deal with that shit, though. In fact, they'd rather turn to working on something that doesn't work for them at all. Um, continuing to be a kind of loser. Listening to Three Doors Down. Because that was the song I was just thinking. It just popped into my head for no reason. Because I'm a loser. Hmm. Oh, right. I almost forgot. Jesus. Okay, man. Okay. What's the vibration for this clearant, please? They feel like they're stuck in a cave. Or they gotta hide in a cave. And they're getting cabin fever. Or cave fever. And they want out. They are tired. Okay, so let's see. This queerance. Okay, so this queerance says a lot of shit for somebody who don't amount for nothing, yet believes that they amount to everything. King of Wands right here. Like I said, could be Leo, um, but I feel like it could be more of an Aries, especially with the Princess of Wands up here. You know, having her arms stretched out like, come at me, bitch. I am ready. Like she's ruling, right? 
This person's like hanging off of something that isn't working for them, but they feel like it's going to work. And here we got the Nine of Pentacles reversed over here. So it's just kind of like, mm. Then we have like the moon reverse. Secrets are revealed, but someone does not wish to talk about them. Despite the fact that there might be an enemy in their house, they're loser, you know. Someone might have lost their shit. Um, might be doing things for negative or bad reasons, right? Not trying to be shy or timid about walking away, but preserving their strength as best as they can. Uh, possibly trying to act like a queen of wands, theorizing and calculating because she's uncomfortable and not very happy in this situation. However, once again, this situation calls for a decision, something that'll bring poise or symmetry. And then we got the counterpart, the king of coins, dedicated adamant, and that's probably the person she's gotta come to decisions with, right? Do might be dazed and confused about the whole separation right here, not understanding that, you know, like, I thought we were supposed to be for each other, you know? Had themselves rooted. They became a little bit miserly, um, keeping the security with this situation because they knew it so well, except, you know, someone might have been a control freak. Okay. Princess of Wands. I hope you all got that because I don't remember a damn thing I just said. Literally, like, I don't remember anything that I say in these unless I go back and watch them. Honestly, I'm just saying whatever pops up. Like, I never remember. Sometimes I go back and it's just like, what the fuck is, does that even mean, Faith? What does that mean? What is wrong with you? <laughs> Alright, so this Princess of Wands, right? Running her mouth, but she's got a powerful and dynamic idea. Whether that is based in reality, I don't know. But it has something to do with something very distant in the ether away from her. Something that's long, long from catching. Um, trying to use that spellbinding and charismatic nature, the Knight of Cups. Um, hmm. That's interesting. Okay, so there's a dynamic idea. She might want to use her spellbinding concrism, which there's like stamina potency, it is not. Four of wands, like doors closed, separation. I can't tell if she wants, I don't know yet if she wants to use her charisma to open this closed door, or if she's do, using this in order to, um, Keep up this appearance that, like, she's not as weak as she actually is, but at the same time, it's like this is the Princess of Wands. Like, she happens to just, like, you know, express stupid shit, like, says things impulsively, does things impulsively, really doesn't think about what they do or where they go. So, this might have been just a sudden idea that sprung upon them, like, aha, I know what I can do. Oh, jeez. Oh, well, there's the next three. King of Wands. Leo, Sag, Aries, once again, so this could be the same person, right? Now they're a lot more mature in this. You know? Hmm. Because they have the knowledge. They're not like a newbie. You know, they're not a wanderer exploring the issue. Uh, they're also got the Five of Coins as well. Complexity and concern. And that shit came very quickly. Like, they had, like, okay. So this is when they were younger. This is when they were older. When they were younger, it was like, oh, I'll put on this spellbinding charisma or whatever, I guess, to cover up the fact that they run their mouth or whatever in order to either open a door or keep a door closed, one of the two. But now that they're older and more experienced, they're realizing that they've been that somebody was left out in the cold, maybe them, and it happened with a quickness. It's like It's like they impulsively did something this querent that they thought would be a good idea, but now that they're a little bit older and wiser, they're realizing, "Oh no, I just kind of fucked myself a little bit. This is the wrong deck." I do that every time, I swear. Anyway. Might have been looking for justice between the two, you know? You never really know. People do things for all sorts of weird reasons. Usually the point of, like, understanding people comes when you actually, like, take the time to 
learn about them, I guess. So up here with this Princess of Wands, she poured her cup out, or a King of Cups poured his cup out with a great vengeance. Just be like, I don't fucking care. And then the water just came back and hit him in the face because it's like it's reverse, right? Aww. So, wait. So, like, they impulsively decided to act like... Okay, I get this feeling that this person acted like they didn't care to keep the door closed because I think they're getting that. Just to ruin someone else's day? Or do they feel like it's because someone ruined their day? Because, you know, the King of Cups is behind the one kid that's pulling the flag... And it's reverse, so it's kind of like this kid's being a dick because one kid's having way too much fun by himself and he wants to just ruin it for somebody else. And I feel like it's kind of like that. It's just like, if I'm not happy, you're not either, you know. Love me so much. Alright, King of Wands. Now this appearance a little older. They're happy by themselves, I feel like. They got shit, but... Wait, that's the Nine of Pentacles. That's their vibration right now, but they got this, so... Okay. They got the Nine of Pentacles. Someone's trying to offer... Oh! Empress reversed. What? Okay, what the fuck, Querent? What? Alright, look it. So, like... Okay, the Querent. With this King of Wands right here... Because I feel like both of these are you, because this is supposed to be you, right? But it feels like when you got older, you understood that you weren't a stranger to this kind of concern or complexity, it, but something changed, right? This is a young empress. This is an old, bitter empress, right? This is an older empress. And this younger empress looks like she's having a good time. Despite the fact that... Your vibration is... It, it, it's backwards. It's like you're hiding in a cave. And you don't want to be in the cave. You're actually losing your shit, right? But it's like you're expecting a tenth pentacle from an older empress. Like, you are... Like, here's a younger empress. Yes, but you're ex almost expecting one from a... Much older empress than you. One that's really bitter and has her back to you. Almost like it's a slow moving offer. That's kind of weird. Oh, okay. You're in separate. That's probably the person. So it could be like your mom. Or somebody older than you who's female. Queer it. Hmm. I don't know. If you're really with an older person, Quirin. Like they're probably not gonna put up with your shit. Like I'm, I'm just letting you know. Like, like I don't know, man. Like the older you get, the less you give a shit if people give a fuck. You know. Thoughts and feelings. Three of Pentacles reversed. You're kind of hanging off of your stuff, man. You're kind of like not as balanced as what you you think or feel. You might be recognizing that too, Quirin. You want that shit to end. You want it to mutate, regenerate. You want to find your strength in all this. Leo's card once again. And you want to be able to navigate through this shit without any sort of problem. Right? You just want to find a way out. You're tired of feeling like you're hanging off of this pentacle and people are watching you all the time, I feel like. We got the Eight of Pentacles down below, which is thoughts and feelings. Uh, or the root of the thoughts and feelings, I mean. Uh, you were trying to work on something, but there was no more wonder or chance with whatever it was that you were looking for, right? In fact, you didn't even have the imagination for it. And there's the Three of Pentacles again. It's like you can't come out of something? You couldn't work it out with somebody who you thought was a fucking idiot? Like, usually a mentor or sage, the Hierophant's like a teacher or somebody you look up to. Mm. 
Queer, and I feel like you were trying to work something out with this older version of the Empress. But she's older, so it's, like, no offense to you, right? But it's, like, the older you get, the more you kind of, like, understand shit a little bit better. Because you have the experience. It's not that you don't have the knowledge. It's the experience and having that experience in shit. I don't know. I, I have no idea what the hell I'm talking about. What I'm saying is, is like, you know, um, sometimes younger people don't understand older people and older people don't understand younger people. Because older people figure, oh, well, you should know better. But in reality, you probably don't because you're younger. And younger folk usually think old people are, 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 are just angry individuals who just want you to like work yourself to death but in reality it's not like that it's just like that's how they learn most of their ethics so you guys might not even be seen eye to eye with each other i feel like so you probably think that they're stupid just putting that out there so their vibration the nine of pentacles reverse it feels like you're hiding in a cave which is confusing me because it's like you got you got the nine of pentacles upright and like, I like, like, okay, look at, like, the younger, older thing, especially between females, right? Like, if you're taking a chance of, um, trying to make someone feel like you're happy and they should just come up and offer to you, even when they're angry at you, that's probably not the right solution. Especially with older bitches, because older bitches aren't going to apologize for shit, man. I work with a lot of older chicks, and none of them apologize for anything. Ever. <laughs> but it's like, I mean, if you're having a good time, what's there to offer? You know, the 10th is just a bonus. You got 9. But, you know, I don't know. Hmm. Or it could be that you don't want to make offer one of your pentacles up to make things work. Hmm. It's really up to you. All right, so the vibration, back to that. Nine of Pentacles, reverse. I don't understand, but okay. Uh, oh, King of Swords, domination, mastery. Yeah? Okay, do, okay, wh what? Clearant, you're a confusing person. Okay, so... I get this weird feeling, like, I don't know, like, you could have been lovers, you could have been in a relationship, you could have been anything, you could even be co-workers, right? But it's like, you feel trapped in the cave, you're trying to find ways to master, or find ways of mastering what it is that you're surrounding yourself with, but you got a little heartbreak, and that's not bringing in what you're expecting it to do it's like whatever relationship you were having or dealing with it's affected you to the point where it's like even if you had stuff you're only it's like queer and and, and whoever's dealing with this queer you know like if it's you okay if it's not you oh well enjoy the show either way doesn't really matter but queer and i feel like you were kind of flaunting your happiness and then acting like you didn't give a fuck that the other person was unhappy. No matter what you did to him, it was just kind of like, no, you're not allowed to be happy without me. But I'll be happy without you, but you can come up and offer me something. But it's like, it might have been an older person, you know? Oh, dear. You know, um... Queer, it easily could have been somebody who you just let drown for no fucking reason. You know, like, just turn your back completely. Um... Hmm, I haven't gotten this one reversed yet. Give me a second, because I haven't looked at this one yet. Reversed. I would say... <coughs> Sorry. I would say you have to pay a significant amount of money to get rid of a bunch of bugs in your house. That's what I would say this is. Reversed. For now. I'm not sure if I'm correct in that. Usually it's like a bad offer. But it also could be like you bought this land and then all of a sudden like it's bugs. Bugs everywhere. They're just infesting shit. 
Uh, and that caused you maybe not to feel like a victor queer in all this. There was no victory to share with anybody. Uh, no one looked up to you at this point, I feel like. Maybe you feel like you were the enemy or anything, but I don't feel like it's the enemy thing. I feel like it's more like there was nobody to look up to you and what you were trying to do because it didn't work out in your favor. So now, everything's packed up. I mean, the door is still open, but everyone's freaking leaving, you know. Uh, but you attempted to close the door in order to get some the older one to come to you. Which is like, that's some bitch-ass move. You know, like, 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 hmm. I mean, like, you dumped your cup of feelings just so this person, you know, couldn't be happy. You were literally pulling on their heartstrings, I feel like. Just to get them to come back to you, but it's like, this is an older bitch. What makes you think she's gonna come to you? <laughs> Alright, let's clarify. Three of Pentacles reversed up here. You gotta get into your, uh, trances, your spirit mode. You gotta have your spirit dog. You gotta have your walking stick to run the snake. You need to look beyond the physical, the 3D, as they say. Because there's no running home to daddy. Um, it's like you can't go back home. Like, it, it, yeah, it's kind of like a parent. So, Quirin, if you're dealing with a parental figure, it's kind of like... One more, because I feel like you're actually trying to figure out... Yeah, you're kind of expecting, like, this other empress, possibly your mother, you know... You might be expecting her to come to you because you don't want to come running to them. It's just like you can't go home, um, but you are expecting them to like let you get some coin every once in a while. That's kind of weird, Clarence. Kind of dickish too, but that's kind of weird. But it's like you have to look inside to realize this. That you're expecting them to still come save you despite the fact you won't deal with them. Eight of Pentacles down here. You were trying to work on something. Mind you, the Hierophant and the Empress. Taurus energy. I almost forgot about that. So it definitely could be Taurus involved. Uh, bird, 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 bird. He's just sitting there with his uh, freaking bird chilling out. He'd be like, say who? Say who? Ooh, like he's trying to teach his bird tricks. He's just chilling. Um, he ain't hostile. He ain't nothing. He's just like chilling with his bird, having a conversation, trying to teach his hawk how to say who. King of Swords, right? I don't know. If he's. Uh, I don't think he's sending the message. He could. He really could. He could deliver something, but I don't think he's going to. His bird friend came by. He's all groovy. The sword is in the ground, so it's like there's balance here with this person. Yeah, this person's just putting their sword in the ground and taking their shit and walking off because everybody else is just like, you know, expecting shit. Like, everyone's looking at them like, how, how, how do you have so much more than this? And it's like, bitch, I carry my house on my back. My name is Olga. Go get your own coin, you know. Whoever this is, they are completely cool, even after being left out in the cold, like they made their own way. Or maybe they found someone else who was left out in the cold, too. One more. Oh. Oh, okay, never mind. Um, this person had their sword staked in. Okay, I got it now. They had their sword staked in, meaning they weren't trying to aim for any sort of truth. They got the bird on their shoulder. It's not flying, so it's kind of like, you know, this king of swords could easily, like, just let shit be known, but he's just kind of, like, chilling. But he got left out in the cold because it's like... He got caught up in a trap that he wasn't paying attention to. 
like hung up on his own shit, you know? Let's see. Nine of Pentacles reverse up here. Okay, someone won't let somebody take a nap. They keep bothering them every like two to five minutes to make sure they're asleep, but they can't sleep because they keep getting bugged. I actually had a flight attendant in Philadelphia do that to me once. Like, I was trying to sleep, and every time she'd walk through and be like, you need to make sure you're stuck under the seat. And it was just kind of like, dude, can I just go to sleep? You've been bugging me. At some point, I was just like, look, you wake me up one more time. I'm throwing this in the middle of the aisle. Leave me alone. Ugh. Peoples. Yeah, this person who won't let the other one sleep, it's like they keep trying to do tricks to bring things together, but the other person knows, um, you're trying to set me up, and now you're trying to act like you're the good guy. Now. Hell now. Go somewhere with that shit. You know, it's like they recognize them, they just can't see it yet. You know, this person's trying to manifest something, I feel like. What? This person... Okay, this person who's in the cave. They keep going up to, like, the sarcophagus of a body. Or the person who's at rest in the picture, right? Not letting them rest. Because somehow, or some way, they are trying to manipulate things to look like everything was out of their hands. Everybody else had something to do with it. No. This beginning of this reading had the Two of Swords. The Two of Swords had popped up earlier. Now it's here again. This person wants to be like, oh, I, I have no idea what the fuck's going on. You, no, you know damn well what's going on. You know. <laughs> like, your secrets are coming out up here with the moon reverse. You know. It's like young empress versus the old empress. Like, holy shit. Like, it's like they want to pin two people against each other and then, like, act like they didn't see it happen. Or put somebody in that situation where they don't see it happen. This orienting people, you know? So the moon reverse. Queen of Swords. Elusive, mystical. She is not. She is well known with these secrets. Counterparts of the King of Swords down here. Uh, trying to get out of a black and clouded situation. Where lunacy and madness had once reigned. So yeah, she's a scorned woman, but she's no longer trapped and she's no longer crazy. So now she's just fucking dangerous. Like, she has her logic, but it's well known what the fuck she's going to do. And apparently a seeker came out that she might have been a scorned woman. An attempt to stop from being clouded and stop from being crazy, but it's like... Or someone figured out that someone was acting this way because all this shit was going on. Knight of Swords. There's a lot of error. Definitely Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And everyone's pretty much on the board. Um, with the exception of all the Earth signs. Well, there's no Capricorn. Which, you know, saying that now. Um, there is... No, oh, no. I, actually, everybody's out here. Everyone's out here. I was wrong. Um, Knight of Swords. He doesn't want to come in and fight or say anything. We got the Justice card reverse. There's something that's unfair. Someone is not awakening. Oh, wow. Judgment and Justice? Two karmic cards reversed. This knight isn't trying to do the right thing. And he sure as fuck isn't trying to wake up to do that shit neither. No, no, no. No, no, no. He's not trying to. He's straight up like, nah, it's cool. Like, it's not that important for me to be an awakened one yet. They just want to be happy. They don't want to do the right thing, and they don't want to try to realize what is and is not the right thing. They just want to be happy. They just want to fuck off and do whatever it is they want to do. However, they got the six of wands here once again. And that showed up earlier, I think. Somewhere. I think it was just in a hand. Let's see. Someone doesn't feel like a victor or they had enemies in their house. They just conked everybody. Queen of coins. There she is. 
Capricorn Taurus Virgo comfortable and blissful she is not could be an unfaithful spouse uh, could be an overbearing mother or, or spouse could just be someone who's easily annoyed because it's just earth signs like earth signs just get easily annoyed with anybody um, Ooh. Okay. You come here. You come here. <clears throat> you know, if someone wants to make a bold decision because they're hungry and intentions for something, but they gotta look deep inside for that stuff, right? What else with this lack of victory right here? Because we got the Queen of Pentacles. She's not comfortable or happy. She could easily be this empress over here. She might be the older woman. Um, going around just slaughtering the animals rather than, like, actually doing anything with them. Ooh. Mmm, that's a lot of... I guess she's trying to move on the past or something. I'm not sure. Um, intuition twice with these two. And then we got the Queen of Cups right here, who's the counterpart to the King of Cups. So, yeah, this definitely could be this um, Empress person as well as the person who the King of Cups is dealing with. Uh, three very strong feminine energies right there. She might be the crazy one, but we're going to find out. Anyway, back up to the top. Let's see. Moon reverse. Yeah, someone's not trying to let the truth fly free, but it's gonna come out, so it really doesn't matter. Yeah, and, well, they're probably gonna fuck it up and actually expose themselves. Yeah, well. So, oh, so that's why the um, Page of Wands is up here. Okay, someone's going to end up, Queerant, saying something, whether you know it or not. But it's going to be like, you know, trigger, right? It's just going to fuck you up, right? And what's going to happen is, is, um, whatever somebody says, it's going to mess with your emotions to the point where you're just going to say some really open mouth shit. And that's going to cause people to realize something about whatever this dynamic you're having is. Whatever it might be. And people are going to realize you've been doing fucking tricks and shit. Just trying to keep up. Moving forward. Let's see. Knight of Swords Reverse. You ain't fighting. You ain't trying to do nothing. Um, people are leaving while the door is open. And the party is over. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Queer it. What? Queer it. Okay. There is like a total togetherness with somebody. But everybody at the party is getting ready to go home. Like, there's still there was still time to make it to this open door before it closed right here. But the tower got struck not once, but fucking twice. Because someone was too much of a um, control freak or just a person who needed to hurt smaller things in order to feel better about themselves. King of Swords reverse and he's upright right here. This is you realizing that like um, this door actually got closed because of the way you possibly behaved. I hate to say. Like I'm not trying to be that guy but you know like that's kind of how I'm seeing it. It's like If there was another chance, there might be something that happens that causes the tower to hit twice. It's going to be like another whammy to this whole scenario, right? And it's going to be come at the cost of someone realizing that, like, you know, they like to crush small animals to feel like a man, you know? Which is just like, what the fuck is wrong with you, you know? Like, you should be holding that lizard with care because it's tiny and its life is very... Um, fragile compared to that of the human body. Not squishing in your hand and be like, <laughs> I'm a tough man. I, like That's how I feel with this version of the King of Swords in this deck. It's just like he's just crushing the lizard for no reason other than the fact that he wants to be a jerk. 
and he wants to look powerful, but he only does it to people who are much weaker than him. Like that childish kind of shit, right? Alright, last card. Six of Wands Reverse. Definitely could be dealing with a Taurus, but there's definitely no um, commitment, no marriage, whatever. We got the Queen of Swords here. She's reversed again. She's got that butterfly, but she's just like, you know what? Fuck the butterfly. Everyone's getting some. That's literally how she comes in. Everybody's getting some. That's kind of harsh. Um, <laughs> but that's how she's coming in. She's just like, fuck this shit. I'm just swinging on everybody. Mm. Yeah, so I'm reckon Querent. Whoever sees this and that does resonate with, be very careful because there's going to be a tower that is going to hit the second time. Like the situation was already dead. Someone resurrected your dead bodies, made you into zombies, and then like murdered you with silver bullets or whatever they kill zombies with. I really don't know. Like is it silver bullets or... No, that's just a hit to the head. Someone just... Yeah, so you're going to be going ahead and... Poss someone's gonna be going in wanting to possibly crack some zombie skulls because someone decided to like res try to resurrect the tower and it got zapped again to make sure that that shit's not happening so yeah sorry about that queer like that's just what I got for right now for anyone who resonated 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 I hope this helps you out seems kind of harsh but, you know, it happens. Uh, I don't know. If you enjoyed this reading, like, like, share, and subscribe. I'll appreciate it, but no pressure, of course. Um, I will see you guys later. Take it easy. Bye.